this tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to join your Windows 10 Pro or Enterprise machine to your domain via PowerShell. So the first thing you need to do is you need to go to Control Panel. And we need to go to the Network Settings to include the DNS settings of your domain. So what we're going to do is go to Change Adapter Settings. Click on the adapter that you're currently connected to and go to Properties. Go to the TCP IP4 properties, go to advanced, go to DNS, and then you could include the DNS server here. So once you type that in, you will go back and close out of everything. And again, the DNS settings, you would have to set that up in when you created your domain controller and your domain. Okay, so once you add the DNS settings, now what we could do is we could go to CMD and we could see if we could ping the domain. And it looks like we can. So that confirms we could join the domain. And there's two ways to join the domain. The standard way is by going to your taskbar, right clicking and then go to system. You go to system info. You go to change settings, you go to change, and then in here you will put in the domain name. Usually I put it all caps. And then once you click OK, it's going to ask you for the domain credentials. So you will type that in and then you will go ahead and cancel or click OK. And then your computer was going to ask you to restart. With PowerShell, you will open PowerShell ISE. And I have the command here. So I'm gonna put this on the description. So from here, I would just go ahead and put my domain. And then I'm gonna change the user to my administrator. So you will put in here the username for the administrator. And then you will copy paste that, or you could type it in. And then you will press enter. So you will get this window here. This means that your machine is ready to join the domain. Just put in the password and you're good to go. So that's how you join the Windows 10 Pro or Enterprise machine to your domain. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions, issues, leave your comment below and please subscribe.